Hello everybody and welcome to Video Obscura. Today we're going to play uh, 10,000 Bullets. A game that is, well, one of my favorite uh, games on the PlayStation 2. Just gonna ch check out some controls here because... Uh, see if I can change the camera. I just tried it out before and the camera was a bit wonky. But uh, it seems you can't control stick. I kind of wanted the inverted uh, horizontal camera because it was acting up a bit weird. <coughs> but we'll skip that, it doesn't matter. Excuse me, it's for my get bit coffee today. But uh, anyway, let's start up the game. My first memory was of blood flowing. My first thoughts were of revenge. That's how it all began. It's probably gonna end the same way. Hot off the Matrix with long leather trench coats. I mean, why not? A couple of years after the Matrix, actually. Anyway, so once again, here's to God for keeping us alive. You're thanking God? That doesn't sound like you, Judas. Hey, this means you guys won't be working for a while, right? <coughs> For the rest of the week at least, but if God sees fit, we could be taking it easy for the rest of the month. Yeah? I got an idea, since there's not much of a crowd. I'll go and cancel the last act so we can go home together. Sorry, but I've got something. <coughs> I've got to do something. I'm going over to Butchos. Come on, Crow. Haven't had a free night in a while. Let's just buy a few bottles of wine and enjoy ourselves. Sorry, Judas. <laughs> That's your name. I made a promise. You and Keiko go home and I'll catch up later. So, see, already from the get go, there's obviously some kind of love triangle going on. So, yeah, let's move uh, to the Bucho shooting range. <clears throat> Get started on the tutorial. Ready, Crow? Yeah. You're gonna love this new equipment we got. We can project holograms in 3D space. We're using retinal projection, state of the art, borderline, science fiction stuff. Man, it's just like this movie that I saw. Just started already. <sighs> okay. My note scene sounds like a bootleg Neo. From the Matrix. From the Matrix. <clears throat> I don't know what's up with my throat today. Got a bit of a cold, maybe, coming on. Skip the troll? No. Let's check it out. I'll move in control with the left analog stick, obviously. Square to attack, press down or start to reload, push X to jump. Here's where the log on system comes into place. Push R1 to log on, R2 to switch between targets. It's a hold down R1, so, so you've got to use your fingers a bit differently than you're used to probably. <coughs> 
this is what I'm talking about. This uh, feels weird. It's kind of inverted from other character action games. Oh, three, two. Back on. There's the bullet time system. Unleash consecutive attacks to perform combo attacks and revive your gun gauge. The more combo attacks you unleash, the more you can revive your gun gauge. So this is... There's uh, many other special attacks to utilize the power of gunsling and gather new skills as you play through the game. Acquired skills can be used once they're saved into the skill slots. The skill slots can be switched by pressing the left and the right directional buttons. So yeah, this game is a lot about uh, managing your gun gauge. HP and gun gauge can be revived by collecting certain items on each stage. It's a tutorial on basic gameplay. Shoot on cans to cause large explosions and wipe out multiple enemies at once. There are other objects on each stage to explore as well. So yeah, we got a thousand points. I don't know if we got enough for to buy skills yet, but uh, let's check out that screen anyway. Character profile. Crow takes care of the dirty work as a hitman for Papa Tonio's crime syndicate. Currently partnered with Judas, who taught him the tricks of the hitman trade. Though Irish by descent, Italian by nationality. Age 24, a standard character who's equally skillful, both with attacking as he is with defense. You get unlock uh, d uh, different characters uh, while playing the game. Skill rank up. Let's see what kind of skills I got. Avoid, dodge enemy as attack. Next rank 3000, I do got 6000 acrobatics. Grapple, HP up, that's always good. Let's uh, take some more HP, why not? And. to avoid. <clears throat> That's it. Let's see what's our, in our skill slots. Gotta avoid blind in this one. That's only two skills I have, so no use to equip the others just yet. All the options. That's the options from the fall. Let's save the game. <clears throat> This might take a little bit. Usually does when you create a save game on the memory cards for the first time. So anyway, this game only came out in uh, in Japan and Europe. So that's why uh, it's a good fit for Video Obscura. I think it's it's uh, weird that it never came out in, in English. But you do get the option when you start it up to, uh, <coughs> to run it at 60 hertz rather than 50 hertz. So, yeah, I mean, the framework is definitely there, but maybe Taito decided that they weren't gonna publish it for the US. I wonder. Nice work, you definitely got something I don't have. Your kind must have been born holding guns. It's like you can see the bullets coming at you. If I could do that, my work would be a breeze. Anyway, this means I can start fixing this place up. Turn it into a cool playground for the kiddies. A trendy dating spot for the teenagers. 
and a training ground no assassin can do without. <coughs> Providing for everybody, that's my motto. Pretty grimy for a dating spot. Well, that was a fun diversion, I'll be going now. Come on, you just finished that one test, why don't you stick around and practice a bit more? Pass. That's to, to run the tutorial again, I guess. Yeah, alright, feel free to come back whenever you, are, you want. I'll let you practice without a reservation. You don't take reservations, Bucho. Actually, accidentally clicked the wrong place. <clears throat> Move one up here. There we go. Back to the apartment. Hey Crow, I kept waiting, but you didn't. I didn't think you were going to be so late. Sorry, why, Judas? Well, since we we're going to be together for a change, I thought I'd cook something really special. Just just gorged the whole thing down, and now he's snoring away in the bed. I'm feeling a bit shy. It's not every day we get treated to a woman's touch like that. Honestly, after three years of living together, anyway, if you're hungry, don't worry. I'm not sure I hid your portion away from Judas. I'll go and warm it up. Aren't you going back to your room? I'll stick around till you're finished. It's a bit lonely eating on your own, don't you think? So yeah, you can move around back and visit locations again. Hey girl, I think you just went out. Did you check the pub? Are you going to the club today? Yeah, after my voice lessons. I'm sure I'll be leaving this town someday, so I gotta make sure I'm ready when that happens. You've definitely got a future, unlike me and Judas. God, Crow, you're always saying things like that. When I go, it'll be all three of us leaving together. Ominous. Coming on nerve today, Judas isn't here yet, and Keiko hasn't left the flat yet, right? I'll come back later. Yeah, it's a pretty straight path, really. Just gotta go to the pub. <clears throat> For drinks? Have you eaten yet? No, I didn't feel like it. Leftover stew always tastes a bit funny. I don't mean to bother you, but we've got to talk about work. Hugo, the bookkeeper, has been missing since yesterday. We've got to find him and bring him, bring back his books. That's a direct order from Papa Tonio. Once we get rid of him, we'll head for his flat. Which is all about shooting dudes. Well, the entire game is about shooting and also punching dudes. Let's just save right before the stage for good measure. I won't have to sit through cutscenes in the event anything happens. Yes. No sort of auto save. Uh, option. Well, it's a bit slow on the save. Used to begin, yes. It's too quiet. I don't like it. This time it's more than just a contract hit. Okay, like always. I'll take point. You watch my back. If we make it out alive. Two Jamesons, I'm by him.
Let's play. Let's play. Come on. Gotta get grasps with the, the system here. Attack somewhere. Ha! Yeah, lots of explosions. That's what I'm talking about. No hidden stuff here. I guess not. Ha! There, I ran, I ran out of the gun cage in a timely fashion, but that's okay. My name is Keats Eichmann. You are Crow from the Tonio family, or should I call you Bloody Crow? I don't remember ever getting that notorious. You won't get famous by killing me. I am not interested in fame. What I want is your life. Why? What makes me so special? This is the destiny of our kind, Crow. There's some pretty good uh, villains in this game. Uh, or bosses, if you'd like. All the characters are, are pretty, pretty amazing in their own right. But yeah, on to the, the boss fight. We and go. now you shall die. Ha! You can't run from me. Got him proper quickly. It's an easy boss fight. But only got D rank, because I got a low combo. But that uh, gave me some more skill points, so we can level up the skill some more. See what kind of skills we can get now. Some uh, gun gauge might actually let's just spend them on increasing the gauge. Seems like a good option. Then 
save it. Yes. But yeah, the characters you unlock are all pretty interesting. Uh, got uh, on that one character uh, who uh, doesn't use guns, who use martial arts instead. Actually, pretty interesting change of system. <coughs> all right, I think it's time for you to die. Damn. What was that about? Someone you know? No, but he seemed to know me. <clears throat> there they go. Does it hurt? I'm fine. You're not fine, Judas. Why had you got shut eye? It's my fault. I should have protected him. Protected me, Crow? Do I have to remind you? I was the guy who told you about guns. This happened because of my mistake. Judas, can't you just stop this kind of work? Haven't you done enough to repay Tonio's debt for keeping you safe? Kago, I abandoned God and ran away from him. For that, this is a job I deserve. Oh, Judas. Oh, Judas. I'm just going out for a bit. Oh, I'm sorry, Crow. Take care of yourself, okay? So yeah, while he's dark and brooding, you get the option to uh, pop around and visit the various places. Hey Crow, how's work going? It was a waste, uh, waste of time. Now I've got someone else to look for other than you, go. Looking for me, perhaps, Mr. Crow? Pretty gutsy for you to show yourself. That's the way I do things, Mr. Crow. So given that we're both creatures of the same blood, perhaps you would care for a pleasant conversation? Who told you? That I cannot say. Did somebody hire you? That I cannot say either. Are you going to kill me? Yes. I too am searching for the path to the kingdom. And for fighting you just now, I realized something. Your blood is extremely pure. This I cannot afford to let slip. Let's take this somewhere else. Are you ready to fight me then? This is the destiny of our kind, Mr. Crow. You can't run away from it. I don't want to fight you. I just want to, f to fill that sneering face of yours with lead. That's all. So, straight into another fight. Start out. We'll probably win it. Our final showdown happens here. Disappointed, Crow. Maybe I was expecting too much from a coward in a cheap gangster suit. I prefer to think of myself as a realist. Kind of weird the way the cutscenes cut out. Feels like the the ending in the middle. Rather naturally. Oh well. Doesn't matter that much. Save that health power up in, in case I get in trouble.
defeating enemies. Ha! Nice sheep. Look at that. the grunts out of the way. I don't remember what the blind shot does, but uh, I can try it out in a second here. Fabital loading, but you know, that's what you kind of get to expect. And now you shall die. Is it just like the Matrix? You can like see the bullets coming at you, giving you time to dodge out of the way. Like that is what you want to get out of the way of, away from. You can't run. Trouble, but he's almost down there. Got him. It can't be. This is a normal. Might have to knock it down on easy later. If I uh, keep getting killed too much. But it's kind of like Ninja Gaiden in, uh, in that respect. That if uh, you die too often, it says, "Hey, you should probably play it on easy." Disorder shot level two. Shot, uh, unacquired skill used to shoot randomly and still hit an enemy. That sounds really good. Take that instead of the blind shot. Maybe skill used to attack enemies to the side. A single shot attack would come in handy. Critical shot. Yeah, I'll use um, disorder shot and. I think I'll set this disorder shot there. Void there. Wait, void there. Yes. Blind. And avoid. Yep. So 
Let's fill in the settings. Yes. Exit. Save. Save the game. Yes. <clears throat> and on to the next. <laughs> Last chance. Did somebody hire you? I'm not going to tell you. Even if I fire around right between your eyes? As a realist, you know what'll happen. Yes, I know. But I'm no coward. Very well. I'll tell you one thing. Start talking. That blood that runs through your veins, that gives you your powers. Others have it, and they can sense it in you. You'll be killing until the day you die. Do it. Goodbye. That takes Kev Keats on to chapter two. So you still don't know who sent him. Why would anyone want to kill? Never mind, that's too easy to answer. The same goes for you, Judas. But never mind that, how's your wound? It's alright. Anyway, about Hugo, there's no easy way to take care of that job. Given that we've got these assassins to deal with, finding this guy is going to be the least of our problems. This whole thing stinks. Yeah, we might want to find out what's going on. I'll go and ask the informants I know. I'll ask around too. Don't get killed, Judas. I'm not old enough for you to be worrying about me, Crow. Yeah, let's ask around here. There's a new area up there. Just check out if if, if you're visiting this stage means we gotta replay it. Or a cramp up slum. It doesn't. Talk to the informants, see what they know. Did anything unusual happen recently? <coughs> yeah, somebody's out to get you, and he's no amateur. I already know that. I can't pay you for that kind of information. Oh yeah? I think you might want to hear what I gotta say. I'll come back later. This is the guy I think it is. It'll be okay. Anything to do here? No. I think we're good. Let's save first so we don't have to watch cutscenes in the event that I do die. I mean, I did fight the first boss before and I was pretty close there. As I said, it's all about managing your your gun gauge because that's really uh, that's really what prevents you from from getting hit using a void and bullet time to uh, to get out of harm's way to get out of harm's way quickly enough yes what the hell Hey, stranger, the name's Joe, but you can call me like <laughs> What you looking at? Killing you is going to be easier than I... Ha, way too slow. You really a gunslinger, friend? I was hoping for a challenge. Who hired you? The Rodrigo family? Ha, ha, ha. 
think I could afford to look this good working for them? You are not even worth my time. And I'm pretty fast. Hey, fellas, kill this chump. So yeah, straight into the next boss fight. And this guy will probably, uh, he is pretty fast. He's no joke. Let's play. Let's see about that avoidance. See, the problem with cars is that uh, there's a pretty good chance you can blow yourself up if you aren't careful. I knew it would end like this. Doesn't mean I can't try again. Yeah, your position in the in the level really determines where the enemies spawn. Uh, so if uh, you get a hang of where they uh, where they are, they, you can kind of uh, abuse it. Already down. Too bad. I knew it would end like this. But that doesn't mean I can't try again. Let's play.
Whoops. Got shot by someone. I knew it would end like a probably good indication I should knock the difficulty down a bit. Let's go back to the character selection screen. Let's see what kind of options we got. I thought it would ask you automatically, but um Yeah, not quite sure if that's the case. Options. Yeah, I can't change it yet. It'll uh it'll ask me automatically. Yep. It will ask me automatically. But yeah, nothing quite like a good challenge. Let's play. Ha! Exploit the ha! this shot quite a lot. Should uh, be able to to do it. Stick back here and it'll be no problem to take him out. Yep. What I'm talking about. What I'm talking about when I talked about exploiting the the level. To uh, have the enemy spawns appear like you want them. Back there, just a bit, kind of. 
screwed me up, sorta. But uh, I mean, you do need to kill all the enemies to move on, so. Yep, yep, yep. Well, how many enemies I got left to kill? Can't be many, they're not spawning all that much right now. That's the last one. There, did all right. Got me some skill points. Now three thousand. After data, Is the screen skill rank up. Perimeter skill used to kick the enemy into there. We use that a bit. Acrobatic. Just a big fan of blind shot. So, um, how about getting another jump? Well, you know, we could save. I think I'm gonna save some points and see if I can get another rank of uh, disorder shot. because that's a pretty good skill to have against minions at least probably also on enemies who uh, kinda like the first boss Keats who kinda split into several <laughs> But onto the boss fight. What was that all about? Or maybe not yet. Let's look around some more. Talk to the informant again. You again? Have you got anything? A strange Japanese guy's been trying to track you down. He says he's an insurance salesman, but I say he's no salesman. Hey Crow, do you remember the first night that we met? How could I forget? That was the first job me and Judas paired up for. I made a complete mess out of it. God, you guys gave me a fright that night. Open the front door and would have found two guys dripping with blood lying in front of my flat. I was pretty surprised too. Most women would have run away after seeing something like that. Come on, how could I have left you guys like that? Besides, I knew how to hack you guys since I used to help out with that kind of work in Japan. Were you a nurse or something? I was a nursery teacher. Little boys always have a way of getting small cuts and bruises. Yeah, then they grow up and get bigger wounds.
Let's go to the club. See what's up. A guy just came looking for you. A guy? Yeah, I look Chinese or Japanese. Are you leaving the country for your next job? Well, as far as I know. Hop on down to the pub, see what's up. Hey Crow, some Japanese guy was here, do you know him? I told him to look for you at Bucho's place. Don't know who that could be. Let's go, let's go to Bucho's place then. Follow the... the leads. Hey, how you doing Crow? You got a visitor. Why don't you decide to meet up, up in, in a dump like this? I don't know anything about that. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Crow, or should I call you Nathan O'Connell? Crow's fine, I dropped the other name a long time ago. Who are you? My apologies, my name is Mutsuguchi. I'm a ne negotiator for Orlando Insurance Call. What kind of insurance salesman? What, what's an insurance salesman want with me? I don't have any interest in life insurance. You guys don't get any either, right? Oh no, I'm not here for that sort of business. I've come to pay for your services and to help you escape from this abyss. Abyss? Your life is in danger, Mr. Crow. There are many gunslingers who would wish to seek you out for your blood. You seem to know a lot. Selling insurance must help you sniff out other people's deaths. So what do you want? From time to time, Mr. Crow, inconvenient things happen to our company. I would like to hire you as an operative for our company. So you can take me out and of one dump and put me into another? Forget it. But you I'm done for today. I do believe uh, I do believe you will at least be better off than you are now. You might be right, but there's something I have to do first. See you around, insurance man. Leaving already? Well, take care of yourself, Mr. Crow. Hunt down that other guy. Cramped up slum. Guess he wasn't there. Talk to the informant again, maybe? You again? Have you got anything? Nothing special. Just buy a magazine and take it home with you. Back to the apartment then. Hey Crow, some guy in a suit came and left a message from Judas. You must have just missed him. What's the message? Go to that where Hugo's flat is, he said. You'd understand. Alright, I'll be off. Oh. Hey Crow, isn't there a way that you and Judas can just leave this world behind? No, I'm sure Judas has his own reasons and I got mine. If I didn't, I'd have left a long time ago. Your mother, is that your reason? I've already forgotten my mother's face, but I've spent my life keeping my need for revenge. Burning inside. Without that I'd be lost. Crow, you gotta promise me whatever happens, protect Judas. Without him I... That man won't die. I won't let him. Thanks. Well, because that's what you want. So Crow's a bit of a third wheel in this thing, is he? Right, Hugo's apartment. That was over here. Hugo. Anyone remember Hugo? Underground, online, what's that the name? Had games and stuff on that page. God, I 
barely remember what the hell they were doing now, Yugo. Was it 80 stuff and uh, 80 stuff and flash cartoons and stuff like that? It's been years. Oops. <coughs> Wasn't where I wanna go. There we go. Yes. Now let's see how I'll do against this this level. Whoops, blew myself up there. Shotgun enemies take a, a few more hits than the regular goons. Already knocking me around with grenades here. Yeah. See, I'm not doing too hard. Yeah, I messed up, ran into too many explosions. Let's try it again. Let's play. myself up this time. I'm gonna be a bit more 
more sneaky about it. Before locking myself in here. There we go. It's easy enough if uh, if you don't rush ahead. about here. I thought. Good use of distortion shots. I finally know who hired you to kill me. Well, that really doesn't matter now, does it? After you're dead, I'll be taking your blood. So I kind of like Matrix vampires or something. So yeah, this boss is a bit more speedy. But, um... Let's see if I can pull off taking him down. May the best dressed win! Ha! the attack you wanna avoid. And that one as well. Lightning. 
Ah, he hit me with it. Dodge. Well, he's not so tough. Almost got him down. down. And I got a bunch of points. Ooh, energy shield. Skills. See, energy shield, what does that do? Skill used to con conjure an energy shield that blocks all enemy fire. Sounds really effective as well. But is it better than avoidance? Let's take another rank of disorder shot. And let's try that energy shield. Right, now I've just got to equip it here. Uh, yes. Why don't you, instead of avoid, try the energy shield here, and if that is completely bonkers, then we can use disorder shot and avoid the third slot. Yes. That's it. Let's save. Yes. Saving her, saving. Has been saved. Yeah, I got something to tell you. Me too. <coughs> On to chapter three. That means this was never a simple job in the first place. It was all part of a plan. The clearest proof were all the thugs waiting to ambush us wherever we went. When we got to the bookkeeper Hugo's place, he was dead. Long before we got the job, as it turns out. Giuliano of Twigo Dallas told us everything. He told us he was killed on Papa Tonio's orders. But why would Papa Tonio do something like that? He's got no reason to go after you two. It means that man was the vampire. 
He was the one who gained his power by drinking my mother's blood. And then he returned, looking like he didn't know a thing, and took me in. In that damned patronizing way of his. Vampire? Drinking blood? What do you- Tainted blood runs through my body. Some calls it the golden blood, but I don't, I don't see it like that. My mother and many others were killed because of this blood. Where are going, Crow? You can't. Dudes will look after you. I'm going to find out why they kept me alive. For as long as they did. In the end, my life's the only thing they let me have. Let's see what's up. Well, I'm a chemist. I'm in the lab ready to explore. Let's go to the pub. See what's going down. The matter, crew, you look upset. Do you think so? Well, I'm a Have something to eat before you go. An empty stomach will just put you in a bad mood. <laughs> Tonya, who knows? Since it's a little dangerous out there right now. He might be jumping hotels again. You're probably right. I guess that means we should talk to the informant, maybe. We got some hot tips. There you are, I've been looking for you, Crow. Select a character. That's a begin of the action stage. Crow, don't do this. You can't handle this all by yourself. You shouldn't have followed me. Papa Tonio probably knows about us by now. I can't get you mixed up in all of this. Where's Judas? He's trying to get us out of the country. Good. You and Judas should leave. Crow, you don't have to be a martyr. Think about all we've been through. The three of us have been like a family the last three years. Has that meant nothing to you? Let's get out of here. Together. Damn it. Not now. Huh? This is gonna get ugly. Take cover. Time to shoot some dudes. Wait for them to to enter the arena before you can actually shoot them. Whoops! Running at years. Try that energy shield. Think so. It only works for a limited amount of time. Point.
got some gun gauge back. Down. I knew it would end like this. Yeah, now I'm gonna continue easy option. Let's jump to that. So you won't have to look me uh look at me playing the same stages over and over again. Because that isn't really much fun. You know what? I didn't like the shield that much, so let's let's move that down there. Yeah, let's try it like this. Yes. Let's start with those options. Just get straight into it. So yeah, this is pretty much uh, Ninja Gaiden with guns. That's my opinion, at least. Let's play. Get out of the way. Just a bit too much uh, gun gauge there. Easy, there's definitely still room to mess up. Be a bit finicky. More than I'd like, at least. Yeah. 
So some of the other characters have a blitz option. I think this character actually does as well. But uh, once you reach a certain level uh, with uh, with the bullet time, uh, you can uh, you can start. Um, Start moving in real time uh, while the enemies are still slowed down. Which obviously is a huge advantage. Gay job level 2. Onto the skill screen. And expend some more points. Skill rank up. Age up. See a perimeter skill that increases gun gauge maximum level by 15. Good. Another rank of avoid also sounds good. Put a time, can't increase that yet. Yeah, another rank of gauge. So you've got more options to shoot things. I actually don't need to save all that much, uh, you don't get a game over by dying, so... Yeah, let's not save so much from this point on. There's no reason for it. Come on, let's go without making this difficult, please. Well, I'm a kid. Guess not. Yeah, that's all I've I've ever lived for. What about living for us, huh? Alright. I suppose you can't... You know, for a moment I actually thought you'd be able to change your mind. I'll stop making this difficult for you. I'm sorry, Keiko. Judas left you a message. It says that Papatonio is hiding in the Celio Hotel. That place is filled with his thugs. Thanks. That's more than enough information. And we'll be waiting for you at this Saint what? Saint Amour Square until 7 p.m. Better get there on time, Crow. Better get there alive. More silence and thanks. So dark and brooding. Someone who chooses to name himself Crow is not quite well off. Well, I'm a chemist. I'm in the lab ready to explore. I jumped it straight to the hotel. Shooting dudes. I was just thinking about how I was using 
actually using the blind shot there. I haven't found much use for it. at least. See, the way they got to wait for the enemies to appear, uh, it's actually slightly annoying. Got to wait for them to, to enter the screen completely before you can shoot them. That would be a good spot to use blind shot. Can try it out. Just not quite getting it. I think I'll stick with this. Health and gauge back. Knock enemies into that and shoot them. go. Not a lot of draw distance in here. You know it is an older game. Make no mistake, Crow. Now you really are a dead man. You knew about me all along. Why kill me now? I needed you. 
You were the best killer I had. Now, you're just too powerful. I have to take you out before you become a real threat. You know too much, Crow. You're crazy. The power's gone right to your head. What about the blood? That's right. The power. You aren't the only one with the gift. I got some of your mother's blood in me as well. Get out of that chair so I can put you in a grave. I'm taking my life back. The dramatic close-ups. <clears throat> Straight into the boss fight. Come on, try that energy shield again. You want me? Come get me! It's good against bosses. machine gun. Favors. Get his, his health back. Not on my watch. Papatonio down. Nice. Next level of bullet time. Oh, well, we got enough points to upgrade it. Scale rank up. Bullet not quite yet. 4,000 points. Uh, just 200 points short. Well, a 
let's save. Save the points for later. We can get some skill points on the shooting range. It's worth trying out. Hey Crow, what can I do for you today? If you leave town, you might not be able to come back here. Anyway, do we want to shoot around a bit? Yeah. That's a crow, I know. Attack tutorial, free battle. Let's try attack. Stage one. So these are the stages I played earlier. Okay. Let's try free battle and defeat 180 enemies. Yes. So uh, that seems like an option for you to to grind out some skill points. Maybe if if I do get skill points for playing. We'll, uh, we'll find out in a bit, I guess. I'm just gonna save anyway. You must set up good loot, but you never know. Power outage, something like mess up. Then it wouldn't be much fun to have to go back. So it's good to be prepared. Um. Let's play. Yeah, that's all about killing all these enemies. to take out enemies, but I'm much more worried about blowing myself up. not make it to 180 enemies in this place. Nope. Not like that at least. Let's try it one more time. Let's play.
Nope. Definitely not gonna make it. To 140. But I could try replaying the first stage to see if I can get some points back that way. I just really want that second bullet, bullet time rank. Let's play. Distortion shot. And uh, it looks like I get the boss fight as well as part of, as part of level one. And now you shall die. That's okay, he's quite a pushover. Ha! and got 900 points which should push me over and uh, give me the next level <coughs> yes so yeah you can uh, go in there and grind out some uh, some points if you wanna well I'm a chemist I'm in the lab ready to explore I chopped up the fat rhymes like no one has before I kicked an out of verbs in my speech when I flow Got some sick rap music. Kind of reminds me of uh, Street Fighter 3. Mm -hmm. 
bullet time level two. Fuck, full fuck, oh no, you better run. This with the was as hot and locked this. I wreck a rapper like a car crash. And then his ass got smashed up with six feet underground. It's almost 7 p.m. I think we better get our stuff. It's still 7 p.m. Judas, besides, look! Sorry to keep you guys waiting. It's okay, you came back safe, so you kept your promise. Everything's alright. I got caught up in some nasty business. Sorry, Judas. Don't worry about it, partner. I'll go pick our stuff up. The station, remember, by 7 p.m. Now it's your turn to wait for me. Save the game. Done. Saved. Yes. Sorry. It has to come to this. But I have to kill you. You don't seem surprised. How'd you know? Well, your bloody name's Judas, isn't it? Papa Tonio. He used to say there was a spy in our ranks. That's it? No normal person could have seen Lightning Joe move. I couldn't let you die there, Crow. I was never happier with Keiko as my girl, and you as my friend. There were times I almost forgot that I was a sleeper, and wished those days could go on forever. Sleeper? A traitor. The man you know as Vittario Lecatini doesn't exist. My superiors found out about Papa Tonio. And you too. You think you can kill me? Yes, I can. I've always been better than you. Well then, I guess we'll find out. boss fights where you're probably supposed to die, right? Yep. Sorry, old friend. A tried and true game mechanic. Stop! Unwinnable boss what? fights. Why are you doing this? Judas, answer me. Judas.
I don't remember how I survived. I only remember crawling around the alley, bleeding. To get away from the syndicate, I ran away to England. I read of Keiko's death in a newspaper at a cheap hotel. It was just an ordinary article about how an innocent victim got caught in the crossfire between rival gangs. There was nothing else about it in the paper the following day. Yeah, I guess that is how it is. Most death is pretty uneventful. Sorry if that sounds like a bummer, but that is the case. A job? Infiltration? Oh wow, you know I'd do anything. I was hoping you would agree to the job. It's a very simple task, so I was a little hesitant about offering to someone of your caliber. Alice, don't accept jobs without passing them by me. You always tell me that, Crow. But you know what, it's because you keep cancelling these jobs that we... that we are so broke right now. Unlike you, I need more than coffee to stay alive. It would be preferable if you would accept the job as well, Mr. Crow. Yeah, Crow, besides if it wasn't for Mr. Mitsuguchi, you wouldn't have been able to escape to Japan from the UK five years ago. Oh, I know. Hey, Mr. Yama Mitsuguchi. Since the job is so easy, it would be okay if I did it on my own. Where do I have to go? I've prepared a map of the place. I've also brought photographs of the interior of the building, which you are free to use. Or why are you suddenly so interested in the job? So, uh, now we got the option of playing as Alice. Of course, uh, we gotta level up her skills as well. Let's check out the other areas. Back to the mansion, see if there's anything up here. What's the matter, aren't you? Going, gotta investigate the club, right? Yeah, I guess we gotta go to the club then. Hey Crow, do deals like that really take place here? If you find anything, let me know. I got this little camera I borrowed from Mr. G Mr. Gush Mitsuguchi, <laughs> so you won't need it. Your gun's more important, you know, enough uh, to at least protect yourself, right? What do you mean? Now loading. So, now we uh, get the option to switch characters. You see she got some other skills. Shadow Stab instead of Avoid and uh, Pineapple instead of Blind. Pineapple is a uh, grenade, hand grenade. Let's see what kind of uh, how her skills are set up. It's Avoid is set up. That up with pineapple. No, I don't have pineapple yet. So, but I do have a bunch of skill points. So yeah, let's level up our HP. Get the pineapple skill. Get this one up. level maybe increase shadow step I think yeah that should be it I'll save some points here right time to equip some skills pineapple there pineapple there shadow steps is another form of void skill used to move through enemies at high speeds can be used twice in a row upon activation can dodge all our enemy attacks, collect Shadow Step 3 to activate Shadow Step 3 times in a row and decrease gun gauge depletion. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's save.
jamming jazz music. The game's been saved. Let's start it out. Yes. Let's try out her shadow step skill. Time for work. As you see, she just have uh, a single gun, but that's okay. That's the pineapple skill. Kinda hard to use it if I keep getting shot. But Shadow Step is an incredibly useful skill to get around. Not that useful, I guess. Get shot with rockets all the time. Let's try that again. Yes. Time for work. Grenades again. Yeah. Missiles, Rama. Uh. We'll avoid those. Like that. Time for work. Causing much pain, with the need to Stand somewhere cover. There we go.
Damn it. Well, I guess we've got another option uh, to play as Crow for this mission. And uh, use his abilities. Yeah, that's a nice thing about it, that it does give you options like these. Can I rank any of his stuff up? Rage. Skill used to attack all enemies in your immediate area. Sounds pretty cool. Let's equip that somewhere. Instead of the like the shield all that much. Yeah, that'll do it. Yes. Let's play. Ha! Ha! Causing much mayhem, dropping. Disorder shot. Ah, there we go. Enemies up there. That helps. Ah, so many enemies. So many enemies around here. What is the trick? There's some kind of trick to it. And like this. I know this. Maybe I can. Uh... Oh no. Hide behind the bar. Maybe using rage instead of the soda. Let's take a look at the gun gauge though.
advanced mode. Put a time mode as much as possible. Oh. Um. <laughs> There's another difficulty level. Sure, why not? Disgrace myself down to very easy. I'd forgotten about that. And, uh, you know, since it's on very easy, let's try Alice again. For the heck of it. But I do imagine she's better against bosses with that pineapple grenade. Doesn't seem like a very good skill, it's way too slow. Time for work. Still messing me up here. Yeah. There we go. Tiger, tiger. Some health back. Squirrely camera. You 
forgot, I for totally forgot that. That you could do a lot in the air as well. It's a great, great way to avoid explosions. You notice he doesn't have a kick up attack, but she uses Kung Fu instead. Very convenient. Got the next rank of HP. Two. Use martial arts with the skill not save until the skill slot will take Yeah, let's do. I don't know if I want more grapple attacks. Let's save the points. And save and while it saves, just gotta go FK for a second. And I am back. Right, actually, let's just play one more level. And then call it a night. Yes. You alright? Yeah, I'm okay, I guess. It was really hard to collect evidence with all that shooting going on in there. Don't worry, Mizuguchi already took care of that. Huh? What do you mean? Oh, that was a test. That means I'm in, right? Right. I can go on missions now and stuff, right? Right? She's a rather enthusiastic young lady. Pop into the club again, see what's up. Whoa! Well, that was rude, bumping into me and just walking off. Let's go after her. Something about your way she moves, it's worrying me. Huh? What? What's up? Oh my god, are you saying that she's your type? You're so coarse. Crow! Now, that was actually the character we ran, ran into there is actually Boris. Are one of the other unlockable characters. Yes. This is.
Just shooting at a closed door. Probably I put in some enemies there if she was supposed to be shooting at something. Time for work. Good that it uh, shows a stall opening uh, while you're fighting. You should really uh, have made the game like that. Those guys block your shot, and you uh, kind of have to. Yeah. Use Kung Fu to take him down. Punch them into there. Food. And got a bunch of skill points. Let's save them and head to the next screen. She did all this? Well, well, if it isn't the infamous Bloody Crow. Who are you? Boris. Is that your real name? It sounds like a guy's name to me. It helps cover my identity, Bloody Crow. I don't like being called by that name. Anyway, looks like you created quite a bit of a fuss. What's your aim? I got a hold of information telling me that a sleeper's operative telling me that a sleeper's operative I was looking for had come to Tokyo. Don't worry, your boss knows about me. A man called Wisdom of Snakes, but understand he's only to be referred as the insurance man around here. Well, I'll be going now. Wait. Smell? You mean she was smelling her perfume? 
Are you interested in that kind of thing? We're going. Hey, Crow, hey, wait! Well, I'm pretty sure I didn't unlock, uh, Boris yet. But we'll get to that another time. What just happened? I was so enjoying this job because the pay is so good. Yeah, let me just get to the next save point here. It seems that was quite a catastrophe. I apologize. It seems our information was inaccurate. Inaccurate? You knew all about this from the beginning, didn't you? Yeah, Mr. Mitsuguchi was completely uncalled for. I always thought you were a really decent guy. So did you find anything? Yeah, I recognized several faces from the men that attacked you. I further suspect that the leader of this syndicate is a gunslinger, capital G. Our association has been keeping an eye out for on them. On them. As well. Okay, that's... They're really breaking up this text really badly. Uh, any kind of uh, disruption would be hard for us. We are, after all, an insurance company. Use a gunslinger to catch a gunslinger. To catch a gunslinger. That's crazy. Yeah, it is, Mr. Crow. But that's how our society functions. Hey, where are you going, Crow? I don't feel good, I'm just gonna step outside. Hey, wait, if you're going out, I'm coming with you. You take care of yourselves. So yeah, get the option to walk around some more. Anyway, let's save the game here. And uh, continue on one of the coming days. I like this game a lot. Live for you. But, uh, but yeah, thank you for stopping by. The replay of the stream will be up on my uh, YouTube channel. Also, got a Facebook group uh, now thing that you can visit. It's also called Video Obscura. Uh, link uh, links to that below the stream. But uh, do follow me on Twitch and uh, you'll get notifications when I go live. Follow me on YouTube, you'll get notifications when I make a new video. And follow me on Facebook and you'll get notifications of the new videos as, as well there. As I usually link them on the Facebook page. Anyway, uh, thanks for stopping by and uh, see you again soon.